Hi and welcome back to Warframe. With the leaked information about the um, Vectus Prime, I thought we'll take a look at the Volcar Augment. My mind basically went from, ooh, sniper rifle, to ooh, sniper rifle augment. Would be nice if um, there was just uh, an augment per type, like one for a sniper, one for a bow, one for a shotgun, one for a rifle, one for a pistol, one for melee. When it comes to melee, of course, you can have different ones. You've got the the swords, the um, yeah, the multiple different ones. Um, I'm, I just want to see a bow every time, but it's not. It's a staff. <laughs> But you've got the different multiple variations of the melee ones as well. Instead, they are weapon specific at the minute, so the only sniper one there seems to be is the Volcar one, and you have to get to the fourth rank, which I think is pure, inside of New Loka. It's 25,000 rep, and what it'll do is add 60% extra damage when you actually zoom in and look down the scope. I'm not really sure why this build is in here, but I don't really want to mess with it that much. That's fine, the only thing that would have changed would have been these two mods anyway, which is the lower weapon recoil and punch through, because the fire rate on that kind of counters the fire rate lost on that one. That's a vault mod, that's a nightmare mode mod. Serration and split chamber, yes, they work good together. Uh, heavy calibre does not work that well on sniper rifles because it messes with the accuracy and obviously malignant force and high voltage just add uh, corrosive to this which I still don't know what I was using this for but fast hands because it's only got a six round magazine. Got some volunteers here hopefully this will come up with a damage number uh, 1166 ish and that was 2000 and something. Yeah, I'm sure somebody can always pause that and have a look or I can do that in editing, but for now it was definitely more. That's for sure. So, 60% more? It was definitely added uh, at least 400 to it, which is about right. But, the biggest downfall to this is the fact that it's on a sniper rifle. Um, sniper rifles are not that good for close range. I mean, if people get close to you, you're going to be shooting from the hip, not zooming in to try and get that all important headshot because it will take too long to actually zoom in and get that headshot. And there goes the purity effect there. That is what is making this mod actually worthwhile. Whether you use it for what it's intended for or not, purity is going to help a lot. Just in case, um, what purity does is it'll deal a thousand radiation damage when that happens, the little blast there, and it adds 25% um, health in the top right, you'll see it'll go away when that green thing goes off the floor, and it'll also restore 25% of your health at the same time. The increase of 25% health is a short term thing. It will not stay, it's not stackable or anything else. So it should go away any second now. And it's gone. Did kill you, didn't I? Yep. So this augment is kind of effective if you're any good with a sniper rifle. Obviously if you're no good with a sniper rifle or you don't particularly like sniper rifles, this is going to be useless. It is also pretty useless against the infected unless you are just taking it in for the sake of having the purity effect going off. Um, I will admit last time I did format this I can now remember putting it in there and I can't remember what I was doing or what I was using the weapon for but I had the purity in there just so it got the weapon itself got kills. Uh, uh, <laughs> nearly missed with that one. Just from, uh, how, how the hell am I going to kill you? Uh, that works. Just from the purity going off, it got kills. And that doesn't really class as weapon kills, but all you have to do is have this weapon in your hand for the purity to build up and actually go off. So the augment is useful even if just for adding the purity effect to the weapon. The fact that it also adds 60% damage when zoomed in 
is kind of an added perk, if I'm honest. And obviously, as you can see there, I shot through a wall. Okay, granted, it was just through a wall. That one was through a wall, though. That is the punch through coming into effect, which is also great for sniper rifles. If you can get the enemies lined up, it also works really well. And I will have to admit, I do prefer my punch through recently, and I'm not really sure why. It's the other wall, isn't it? Yep. Always get them two walls confused. So, all in all, it's not a bad augment. It does actually come in really useful. It would come in a lot more useful if I had some enemies to shoot with it, but this is just the curse of the Warframe. As soon as you press the record button. I mean, come on. How often is it you walk into this room and there isn't an enemy standing somewhere ready to shoot you? Doesn't happen that often. Any enemies at all? Other side of the room? Nope. Nothing. Nope. I set off that thing behind us though, because this is obviously a prime frame. Wait, wait. Them enemies. I see enemies. That was nearly 5,000 damage. So... I do like this augment for this weapon, but as I said all that time ago, I think I would have liked it more if it just said for sniper rifles rather than obviously now it goes off and there's nobody around us. I should have shot some more people as it went off and killed him. But yeah, if it just said sniper rifles instead of being specific to a certain weapon type, this would be a lot more effective of an augment mod. But because it is basically stuck to this weapon, it's not that effective. There are a lot of other augments you could put on that would be... Well, not even augments, just lots of other mods you could put on. There's only one augment mod for this weapon. But any other mod would be more effective than this thing. Because it's... Yes, it is good. It does seem to do a really nice amount of damage. But that mod slot could be taking up valuable space, if I'm honest. So... Personally, I like it and I will leave it on here because, well, adding the purity effect does come in really useful, but if I didn't use the purity thing and I was using it solely for the fact it adds 60% damage while zoomed, there isn't much sniping in this game, so I don't really think I would have chosen it for that purpose. Just simply because there is not a lot of sniping in this game at all. I saw that green effect come off from an infected agent, healing agent, but there's nobody over here. That's weird. But we'll leave this off here for now, because yet again, I seem to have killed everything. So, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you next time.